Hello, my name is Henry White, and welcome to the premiere edition of Spotlighting Paradise. winning filmmaker who has produced and directed an amazing and powerful documentary on city farmers. I felt that for people who didn't garden, how would they ever experience what it was like to garden and what the gardens actually meant to people in right. New York City if, they, if the film came from an exterior place. I wanted to do a film that came from a very interior place. Right. My show today is on the Tea Party. Yes, folks, the Tea Party Express movement. How can we label a syndicated news station as conservative or liberal? It, aren't they all owned by the same sort of multimedia conglomerates at it, this point? Don't they all have sort of the same agenda to further the benefit the, okay. of the corporation? NBC is uh, the, the evil one in this. NBC is, is a is an organization that wants Democrats to rule the world. You are the Western Mass Idol Contest yes. winner. You came in first place. Yes, I did. The design itself comes in many different forms. The one that you see here is what's known as a classical okay. seven circuit labyrinth. Very beautiful, by the yeah. way. Yeah. The folks out there, our viewers, what is the pedal people? Um, well, we're a workers' cooperative that hauls trash and recycling and compost in the city of Northampton. Um, we do curbside pickups for around 500 customers. You're here to talk about a book that you wrote called Trauma into Truth. This book is about how just about every single person has suffered a trauma of some kind, right. and they don't identify it as that. Conundrums in our present economy, or econundrums. Econundrums, yes. <laughs> The goal was uh, to to bring music that had meaning, right? And not to make the fluff music, and, right? And uh, it kind of held me to a higher standard mm. with, for my own self, not even for anybody else. Again, try. So I just dig in, or like a bone of a tea kind of thing, bon or appetit. okay. And what is this again? <laughs> it's a barley mushroom soup. Smoky barley mushroom. Delicious. Magic Johnson, all the enshrinings are very, very personal. They took time to spend with the kids, and that's what's important to, to me and the community. Hey, I'm glad to be back up here in Springfield. Town's got a tremendous city. Everybody's been fantastic. I actually just started renting a space on Main Street in Amherst where I make all of my products by hand. Wow. So local, handmade, certified organic. Wow. Certified tri fair wow. trade. I think that's what it really comes down to right. is having open discourse about why do you want to be a stay at home mom? Because mm -hmm. you can be a feminist too. Mm -hmm. And I think some people have a very narrow definition, which can be very detrimental about how to live your life if you really are a feminist. Every day when I would come down here to work, there were, were at least a few more people that I had never met before that were just as enthusiastic as I was to, to help me and Haley work on this project with some of our nation's greatest jazz musicians of all time. I have with me in the studio Flavor Evolution. Flavor Evolution. They had colored restrooms and they had white restrooms. So I want to just go to a restroom and it just so happens to have that sign up there saying white. They used to have signs on all of the restrooms saying black or white. Wow. So I was arrested for a breach of peace. Mm. And I was very peaceful, but you can tell I look so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> We're focusing on biotechnology, green technology, aerospace, um, and specifically what makes STEM Power unique, I think, is that we're strategically located at the One Stop Career Center, and we're really looking to connect and empower the job seekers and really connecting them with the employers that are hiring. Until next time on Spotlighting Paradise, peace and blessings, and keep the faith.